Good evening, everybody. Hello. How are we all doing tonight? Well, it sure is fall. You know what? I'm not gonna stand by and let him stand by while my night gets ruined. Yeah. Am I stupid? Where am I supposed to go? She's totally back. Well, this is great. I mean, I didn't expect a party or anything, but I figured someone would be here. Welcome home, May. Oh, wait, it's Garbo and Malloy. <laughs> <laughs> What's in the news today, Malloy? Markets were up today. <laughs> I'll fucking kill you. Way up. I guess that's all the TV there is today. <laughs> <laughs> Fiasco Fox, you are too dreamy. Excuse me, but where is everybody? It's 10.45. It's closed. So are you the janitor or something? Looks that way. Hello, tree. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> so one thing we're going to be doing is taking this seriously. <laughs> <laughs> I, can, I can make humorous jokes if I want. Otherwise, this is going to be a very uh, dull stream. Of Unless it's a good fucking game. I can make jokes in good games. No. <laughs> and we'll have a Jim Carrey, Tommy Lee Jones situation where I'm like, fuck you and your humor, asshole. <laughs> and Tommy Lee Jones is like, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ugh, this is some dank nature. <laughs> dank nature and garbage. Wow, I haven't been here in maybe 10 years. And apparently no one else has. I wonder what kind of weird animals have babies in there. Dirt possums, night snakes, mystery beasts of all shapes. Amazing wait a, beasts wait a minute. where to find them? Wait a minute. Is that... Does she mean just people come and fuck and have kids in there? <laughs> Hello, May. Been a while. Ah! Oh, May, you gave me a heart attack. Good! What are you doing... Oh... May, honey, we thought you were coming to up near Schnurberber. <laughs> Hold on. We thought you were coming tomorrow night. <laughs> you thought wrong. How did you get here? I walked until I got arrested by Aunt Mall Cop. Oh, did you say hi to Molly for me? No. I say hi for no one. <laughs> F the cops. I'm going to bed. Shut up, Sing. What is... What is that? Is that your... That's the heart monitor phone. Oh. <laughs> You're thing... dying! Shut up! This thing goes off randomly every every month or so. Little wooden duck pops out. Makes the weirdest sound. Honk! <laughs> Scares Dad half to death every time. <laughs> Used to joke it was Granddad getting even with him from beyond the grave. May, honey? Yeah? Is everything okay? What do you mean? Honey, did something happen? I just needed to come home. Well, sweetie, I think you can understand my worry. That's not usually something a college sophomore just up and does. I, I know. Honey, you've got to read this book when I'm done with it. What is it? Well, boy. It's a true story about a boy who grew up in a well. His parents didn't want him, so they threw him in a well. And he was raised by eels. In a well. Wow. Eels. Eels. Eels, honey. <laughs> Eels, honey. Eels. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's how the FBI works. <laughs> kill, oh my kill, god. Kill. Do you know what this reminds me of? What? This reminds me of the wonderful world of Richard Scary. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Now we, all we need is a hat wearing worm to drive by in a weird apple car. Hello, goat. Hello, squirrel. Hey, Mr. Twigmire. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Twigmire is dying of cancer. Oh. <laughs> Get a bag of sour Skittles. Eat all the sour Skittles. Pour your, and then pour yourself a shot of gin. And then take the remaining sour powder in the bag. Pour it into the gin. Stir and shoot it. It 100% will not kill you. <coughs> well, it sure is fall. All the road work crammed in before winter. 
I hope Dennis gets shivved at work. <laughs> Just to scare him. Scare him good. That'd do it. Scare him right in the kidney. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I gotta go. <laughs> hey, Mr. Chazikov. Hello, May. My best worst student. <laughs> yeah. They chose no tails. Yeah, I'm sure. Oh. <laughs> he was wearing glasses. I was like, that dude is scared out of his mind. <laughs> oh, I can't stop. No breaks. <laughs> it's like fucking San francisco we bullshit right here. Elon likes how this game looks like art of extremely old books yeah, and fairy tales. It's very story, story bookish, art wise. It's pleasant. Yeah. Anybody who tells you that tweening can't produce good animation should maybe take a look at this game. Okay, guys in the chat, be honest with me. Is this a walking simulator? Like, is there a game here or is this just walk around and talk to people? Possum Springs, last seen at dusk on June 27th. Yeah, that's what I thought. Weisfer says there will be game, but not much. So it's gonna be 90% story, 10% some things to, some like, uh, gamey things to do. I gotta be honest, that actually makes me a little less interested. Like, I like story too. So I'm, you know, the, we'll stick with it, but... What the hell? Katie Washington has never lost a child? Yo, give me that. <laughs> I need to know. What? I want some of this. I, I need... Give me... Get... 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 How do I... D... <laughs> what? Right there. Oh, D D's nuts. <laughs> oh, man. It bounces. Hit. <laughs> I found the game. <laughs> Wee! We. <laughs> I'm playing catch with myself. Eh. Welcome eh. back, kobold. Eh. 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 I remember you. Hello. Thief. <laughs> oh come on. <laughs> that was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. Cool that people still hang around down here. We used to do that when I was in high school. Yeah. I wasn't in high school that long ago, you know. How old are you? 20? Oh, so you can't buy beer. No. <laughs> How do you do, fellow kids? I too am a youth. <laughs> <laughs> I am normal youth with normal youth desires. Okay, guys in the chat, let me know. When was the first time you actually felt disconnected with the youth? One of the reason I ask, like, is there any game here? Is because this game is queuing up to be like my favoriteist like it it looked like it was going to be my favoriteist kind of game which is this plus adventure game experience Video outpost 2 oh my god that's like oh uh, yeah that's in the in, taco locos <laughs> in the in the town where we grew up there were like there were when we left there were 13 taco locos and one of them was directly across the street from another one and the one was Taco Loco, and the other one was Taco Loco 2. Only there was a Taco Loco number 2 elsewhere in town, so that one couldn't be Taco Loco number 2, so it was Taco Loco 2. <laughs> hmm, pregnant raccoon. I think I have a great great uncle or something on this. Yep, there you go, Anselm Borowski. Anselm? Even in life he was tragic. Can I go in? I guess you're not open, assholes. My god. What? Oh, what kind of weather did I miss? This is nuts. Okay. Oof. Eight clack. months of mandatory. Oh, oh it's, it's a click, click clack. clack. All right. It's got some uh, very impressive giant fucking truffles out front. Oh, my god. Hey, Greg. What are you doing here? Too bad you didn't die at college. Too bad you didn't catch a flesh eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a bear cult. Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs in a freak soda machine accident. God, it's good to see you. Ah! When do you get off work? Now! Really? D did that dude just fuck off out of his- ah! <laughs> ah! So the party barn went out, huh? Yeah, not sure how it ever stayed open. Wow. Hi. Yeah, hi. She's totally back! <laughs> May, we're totally gonna play a song. You totally have to play bass. Come with me. Let's die anywhere else. Anywhere, just not here. 
Okay, are we doing this diner thing? Yeah! Woo! This pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. Dudes, haven't you heard of the pizza scale? Screw it, pizza good. That's basically the pizza scale. It's really great to be back. Dude, we can hang out every day. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap. What? Is that an arm? That's an arm. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. Time for this uh, arm. <laughs> May, this is like tampering with evidence. Whoa, what's that? Some kind of mark. Hey, Aunt Molly, we found an arm. All right, May, put the stick down and step away from the arm. All right, all right, don't taser me or anything. No promises. Still funny, though. <laughs> Greg rules, okay? Die anywhere else. <laughs> Whoa, there's a whole shitload of stuff. Oh, wait, I forgot to tell you. What? We found an arm on the ground today. Are we still pretending it's yesterday? No, no, we came out of the click clack and there was an arm. Just like, an arm? What? Hmm. That must be some heavy fucking blanket that she's like, <laughs> pulling it back. <laughs> ah, no! What's wrong with you? Damn it! You're creepy. Hey, you kid! Adult. So you're back, eh? Yes, Mr. Penderson. Didn't last long, eh? I've only been back for like 24 hours. Soon will be only a week. Then a month. Then your whole life. You're right. I have so much time left. No one's forgotten who you are and what you did, you know. They may act like they have. But that's just small town polite right there. So, uh, Selmers? <laughs> Fuck this car. So what we're finding is there's plenty of people here who think- who like me, and there's plenty of assholes who are like, Fuck you. Can I help you? I don't think so. So he it sounds like he was one of those guys who was like I built this town with my bare hands. <laughs> hey May. Got cups on my ears. This is what happens if you just swirl your joystick around in a circle. Am I stupid? Where am I supposed to go? Click. Yes. All right, there's got to be some way to make this work. Click. I'll let you. Hello. 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 You're not Angus. No, is this? Who are you? Fuck you, Sofo. <laughs> May Borowski. What are you selling? Do you get a lot of people selling you stuff? Hello. Press it while it's electric. <laughs> Thanks, asshole. Click. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Hello? Ah. <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> like you you go up to your you go up to your beaver and you're like, Hello, and you hear <laughs> and you're like, Who is this? <laughs> Steve. Is this Steve? Whoa, come right in. Hey, dude. Uh, welcome to our apartment. I could have been in my underwear. Hey, dude, don't wear pants on my account. Why was the door unlocked? Greg always forgets to lock it. Greg's at work if you're looking for Greg. I was actually looking for you. Oh my god, it's fixed! I guess it turned out okay then, your computer? Yeah, it did, thanks. I put something else on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? 
Oh, wow, yeah, I used to play it all the time, like, ten years ago. In the age of blood, a pale one will rise, wielding naught but a simple blade. The Demon Tower. What's the parody of Dark Souls? It is, there's burbs. Burb monsters. No oh, man, I want some Cine Twists. Oh fuck you! Now I want Cine Twists. Go to Taco Bell. Heck yeah! You got money. Do they still have Cine Twists at Taco Bell? Like the crispy Cine Twist thingies? I don't know, but you know what I know they do have? Fucking Cinnabon things with thing with goop in the middle. <laughs> Very descriptive. Oh hey, dragon! Welcome. Hello. Oh! Well, <laughs> was I Good job, to... hero. <laughs> I think I just murdered somebody. That seems like something May would do. Wow. Vicious. I can't. Dude, what if we made a game where you're just switching in between different game cartridges constantly? It's called WarioWare. <laughs> but I mean, like, there's a story and an adventure to it. And, like, a process. Oh, that's Fable 3. But <laughs> good. <laughs> oh. Still not sure why I'm doing this. I'm wondering if there's, like, some kind of overarching point. Oh, shit. This game makes me too fucking tired too quick. Eh. Stop. Dude, dick. Holy crap, this boss battle is balls. <laughs> Dude, if I made this game, I'd be fucking proud. <laughs> right? Yeah. We really need to finish Moon Mouse Mafia. True. Oh, fucking God. Fuck you! Oh, by the way, B works at the old pickaxe, so you can go there. Get some tools, lol. Big axe and go on a rampage, lol. <laughs> Listen, asshole. <laughs> it was one time. <laughs> I killed one person! What are you up to today? Greg and Angus and B are going to a party. So I might go out with them. A party, huh? Look at you! Back two days and already the social butterfly. Eat shit, acorn. There's always that one guy who's just a little too controlling in a neighborhood. Wahoo! Wahoo! I can legally shoot you for being up here, you know? <laughs> ah, you'd never. I used to babysit your cat. Yeah. If we don't start getting businesses in the air, there ain't gonna be a Possum Springs. So we gotta do whatever we can do to get the market to notice us. I just want a pretzel. Wait, you actually have VHS? Mostly the adult section back behind the curtain. Whoa, really? Yeah, some folks are, like, really into seeking them out. It's like a whole little scene that goes back before the internet. We had a historian in there last month looking for some obscure video. How do you get that job? I think that's the kind of job you can only have if you don't need to have a job. That's, a uh, That is a, uh... Foof. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was deep. <laughs> Mrs. Miranda has locked one of our guys in her basement twice. Why? Because she's old and she forgets. Maybe if she gets a bill for it, she'll remember next time. <laughs> wee, wee, wee. <laughs> hey, May. What? I was just stopping by to see how you were doing. <laughs> <laughs> Blah, gloom. <laughs> All right, are you gonna arrest me or something? Cause I have a party to go to. Watch yourself, May. I'd really hate to see something happen to you. And being in the wrong place at the wrong time is all it takes. <laughs> Aunt Mall Cop is planning to kill me. <laughs> Excuse me, we made tacos. Tacos? Tacos. Do you want tacos? I want tacos every day, all day. 
The family that tacos together, Rocco's together. Honey, no. What? I am so angry right now. You've all turned against me. May, honey, do you want sour cream on your taco? I want everything. This is hopeless. Wheel me out to the curb for garbage day. Oh, geez, they'll be here any minute. Good luck, kid. Hey, May, I think Cole might be there tonight. What? Oh, my God. Who's Cole? Ugh, that was awful. I hate beer. I can't remember the last time I drank beer. It's not a delicious drink at all. When I first started playing this, the way May talked, I was really cons I was really worried that she was going to be this, like, angsty bitch. You know, sort of like B. And I was going to be like, oh, I hate this character. And I hate this game because I hate this character. But there's something to... She is kind of angsty, but there's something to it that makes it work. And I think it just dawned on me what it was while I was reading through that last section. And it's that the dialogue is smart. Dude, don't shake your guitar like that when you're tuning it. Jesus. That fire's fucking huge. Let's all just sit here and have a nice time around the fire. Well, old Jid boy came from round town. Everyone knew his name. He had an old truck that he ran off the road, but everyone loved him just the same. We all we all knew Jed boy back in the day. Fuck you, a man. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> Oh, off-roading Jim, we call him. <laughs> he knew he really knew his way around a steering wheel. At least it's a good thing he knew his way around a steering wheel, because when he wrapped that truck around the tree, he went right through the windshield, because he knew his way around the steering wheel. If he had, he probably would have been tangled up like a pretzel. Now I think about it, he was wrapped around that steering wheel. It came out with him. <laughs> <laughs> well, now everybody just calls old Jim steering wheel neck. <laughs> I don't even think he has a head. <laughs> Doctor said to, if they were to get the steering wheel off around his neck, they were going to have to cut his head off. And he said, sure, I have no use for this head. It ain't done me no good. So that's when the doctor started to cut his head off. They got damn near halfway through before someone pointed out you can just cut the steering wheel. Wait, Jeb said, though. That's my steering wheel. I need that to drive my truck. No, you just take my head right off, and I'll get back to work tomorrow. <laughs> so they cut his head off. And everyone thought he was dead for a bit, but then, lo and behold, like a summer miracle, he you... started walking around with that steering wheel as his new head. Old steering wheel head, they called him. <laughs> <laughs> this is a smothered brother shoot <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> you know what? I'm not gonna stand by and let him stand by while my night gets ruined. Yeah. I'm going over there. I'm gonna talk to Cole. Can you guys believe this dude playing the guitar? Yep. Playing the douchebag hits. <laughs> like old steering wheel head. <laughs> I like old steering wheel head. <laughs> I like this song. The song is twang, twang, tuning up. Is this a douchebag song? Nah, don't worry, big guy. Screw it, I'm doing two beers. I'm doing beer. I still taste tacos, okay? What? Nothing. Hey, Greg. Well, dude, are you okay? Hey, Greg, did you know I think you and Angie... Angie? are so cute. I did know that, dude. Well, good. <laughs> hey, May. Hey, Coleo. Wow, haven't heard that in forever. I'm just back for a couple days from school and... Shut up already. What? 
the girl at the video store is all like, woo, cute boys. And you're a cute boy, Cole. Oh, thanks, May. I... But I hate cute people. Cute is the worst. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. And it's not my fault I'm a total trash fire. I got nightmare eyes. And the last thing you see is my eyes outside the window and then I stab you with my knife. Don't get wasted, kids. If you keep, if you puke in this car, so help me. I owe you an apology, B. I'm so, I'm sorry. I don't even know what happened. And you got sloppy ass drunk after what? Three cups of watered down beer. <laughs> we is the V best friends, V, and I still love you, B. I didn't get aware of that. Remember when we were scouts together and we caught that turtle? Yeah, Boxy the turtle. He died. I feel like you're mad at me all the time. Why? Why are you so mad at me all the time? <sighs> oh man, if I puke in here, your parents are gonna be so mad at me. Tell your mom I'm sorry, okay? She's so nice. God damn it, May. What? My mother is dead. What? She died of cancer. Senior year. Oh no, she was so nice. BB, are you okay? How do you not know this? Did you forget about my dead mom? <laughs> there you go. I'm sorry, B. I'm a mess. You know, whatever. It's not your fault. You're just a kid. I'm older than you. Two months. Oh shit. We're having some crazy dream shit. We got some bat in the dream. I can float. I can smash things. Durkils... Berg. Durkilsberg? That's a foreground tree. Stupid foreground tree. Won't let me smash it. I'm gonna keep smashing. That's a good point. Hope she's not sleepwalking right now. That seems, again, right at the tail end of part one. Seems like a good place to call it for a night. Alright, I can't really rate this as a game. Yeah, I don't think it was intended as a game. Yeah, this is this is barely it's taken a game. Up, it's taken it the, it's that. taken the mantle of a game, just because it's got nowhere else to sell itself, really. Yeah, this definitely falls into the genre to the interactive genre of visual novels, um, more than a game. That said, the art style is gorgeous. The music and sound direction is excellent. The writing is pretty damn solid. It's fun. I don't it's fun know. Just exp it's fun just experiencing things. Yeah. Uh. It's not fun in the traditional game sense, but fun nonetheless. Yeah. Fuck you, Avast. Nobody loves you. <laughs>